few seconds want me to watch this. It's called This Was Extremely Hard to Watch. And it's a guy called Morgan Barron getting injured. Why do you do this to me? Can I ask you guys to recommend me videos? Why do you do it? Why? This is gonna be a short video. Let's see what this is about. In the world, we're well aware that there are no athletes as tough as hockey players. And that is especially the case in the playoffs. Freaking out already! Don't even know what's happening! War. Well, tonight as Winnipeg took on the Vegas Golden Knights, we got another example of exactly that. And what was a scoreless game at this point? The Jets would enter the Vegas end. Appleton cross ice to Lowry who drops it for Baron and somehow Rossois keeps it out and the puck is loose as a dog. But where is the puck? pile of bodies flying around everywhere ensues and finally we get the whistle but coming out of it we see morgan baron slow to get up is oh god he's leaking he's from bling. the face he's as bling. he goes he's straight bling. to the locker room and oh no yeah, bit of a warning as this oh, is no. pretty gruesome but oh, upon no. replay you can see baron fighting for the puck i swear if that's get on the screen right now i had someone in the neck or something i can't i can't i can't i can't i can't, I can't. I can't. This guy, is he all right? Can someone, I know. Gets pushed from behind by Stevenson and right into the blade of a diving Brossois skate ah! in what is honestly tough to watch. It gets right up under his visor and this could obviously have been extremely dangerous. Luckily, the skate goes right above his eye, narrowly escaping what could have been a very serious Bro. injury. So yeah, scary stuff. And with that he said, right? he did not return oh, for the remainder of the first. You can see where it's slit here. I'm gonna lie, guys. If you were to get slit anywhere on the face, that's probably where you would want to get slit. Probably the least dangerous. But he could have lost a fucking eye, bro. That nose could have been just chopped off. In mind, heading into the second, still scoreless. Dubois for the Jets would enter the zone, feeds Connor in front, and it was the Jets that opened the scoring early in the period with a great play by Dubois and a rocket from Connor. Then, just a minute later, the Knights coughing up Wait, the puck at center. Dubois picks it up and coming down again, this time shoots it, and he scores as the Jets, just like that, take a quick two-goal lead led by Pierre-Luc Dubois. And as Who is Dubois? What the hell has he got to do with the injury? Could approach the midway point of the game look who's back on the bench and you love to see it you just can't undermine the heart of a hockey player great to see he's all right and the you guys are you guys are something else you guys are built different i can't lie if that's me i'm i'm oh wait i'm checking myself into the hospital he got required a crazy 75 stitches in what again could have been real ugly but rock in the cage he's patched up and ready to roll so back to the game the two goals for the jets silence 75 the crowd, but with four to go in the period, the Knights gain 75 stitches. Carl, Jesus. With a Guys, can we just, can we all just come together and just listen to what I'm about to say? That guy got 75 stitches and then came back out to fucking play. I don't know. I don't know. What do you want, what do you want me to say about that? I guys. <laughs> he nearly got his head chopped off. Thanks for showing me that. I'm gonna go for a walk or something. Goodbye.